I don't have that there, man. And for winter time, we changed uh, after cooling, just warming with some cotton. No, all together it's pretty heavy. What did Ashto was called 35? Ah, he, he, Kale, he harvested uh, 35 kilos of honey from this. Wow. Yeah. That's good. It's two. 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 Ну, они там получаются где-то 1,7 килограмма в рамочке. Вау, это хорошо. 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 Oh, look at. Mm. Yeah, yellow jackets yeah. to uh, come in over. Jolty as a. Asshole. <laughs> we don't like them. The back part is you can open just to check. The development and you can what oh, so this is the rabbit it is um, uh -huh. it's uh, useful to check the extra foundation in the summertime you can clean the ship and clean for, the... for cleaning yeah wow and take off some foundation with a drone's brood yeah you know in, in summertime so we're making extra extra frames over the and so it's going to be taken off. Yeah, we tap that. Those bees are going to get slow. Just, <laughs> just carefully later. Yeah, yeah. yeah. In three corpus, it was even more than 30 kilos. Yeah. 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 Today we are visiting Apiary of Vasil Priyatilinka with our friend William from Washington State of United States of America. So some Americans became very funny and surprised about the idea how to keep honeybees in Ukrainian style of beehives. So that's why we are here and we show beehives of Vasil Priyatilinka. We trying to explain everything, what's going on inside, outside, and what honeybees are doing inside this type of beehive. And this is the ventilation. This is great, man. Wow, this is really interesting. <laughs> 